there are times that we have thoughts that thoughts pop in our mind about various situations it can be any situation I mean we have lots and lots and lots of thoughts that pop in to our head some of those thoughts are good some of those thoughts are not so good right some of them are positive some of them are negative and uh, the the struggle uh, that I see a lot of clients having is that they they think that the situations in their life whatever's going on in their life causes them to think that way right so if he wouldn't have done this or if she wouldn't have said this then I wouldn't be having this thought. And the idea of this is, is that basically you are not in a fight with the situation. You're not in a fight with the situation. The situation is what it is, right? The situation is just there. You're in a fight with the thought, the thought about the situation, right? So you're actually in, you're fighting yourself. The, I know sometimes that that doesn't make sense to some people um, because they're like, but Randy, uh, that person just should stop saying that. Or, or But it, this situation should be this way instead of that way. And if it was this way instead of that way, then I would be much better. Uh-uh. No, no, not so fast, my friend. That, that It's not your world. We, we talk about this a, a, a lot, right? It's not your world. It's not your world. And uh, you're living in this world. You're one, you're one out of eight billion people. And you know, it's a cloudy day today just because the world said it's a cloudy day, right? Now, your thought about this cloudy day, you know, people are having all kinds of different thoughts. Some people are like, oh yeah, I really like the cloudy day. Whew, it's kind of cool things off. Some people are like, no, like me, no, I want it hot, hot. I want it sunny and 95 degrees, right? And so the situations are just what they are and you are actually in battle with your thought. You're in battle with yourself. You don't have to be in battle with yourself. It just it just takes a self-awareness, knowing how you th how you're thinking, and then it takes some skills. We like to use cognitive behavioral skills, some skills to use to change those thoughts, to reframe those thoughts, y'all. All right. And once you reframe the thought, then the situation continues to be like it is, right? But you don't feel you don't feel the frustration or the anxiety. Um, or the anger that's associated with the thought not the situation right it's it's the feeling that's associated with the thought that you're having about the situation that's a huge huge statement right there underline it highlight it your feeling your emotion your negative emotion is connected to the negative thought about the situation. It's not that your negative emotion is connected to the negative situation. No, no, it doesn't go like that. It goes up to your your emotion, up to your thought, and then the situation. Hope that makes sense, y'all.